everybody, welcome back to Reminix D4. Let's play Commodore 64 games, Reminix, have a good time. It's Suit Yourself here. I'm Espresso Steampunk. Alright, and we are going to play a game today that we've totally prepared for and not uh, making up right now. Let's shout out on three. Alright, one, one, two, three. three. Sticky Bear Mask. Indiana Math. Jones. What? I said stick air math. Oh, sweet. Although India, I remember loving the crap out of India. Um, as I did. But, I mean, I could say the same about Alien, and we never beat the first level. As That's right. And then I did, and then it turns out the rest of the game is no more forgiving. Yeah, actually, I take it back because the first level is like a quiz. So technically, it was the second right. level. Right, yeah. What, was that just DRM, or was that just like, hey, fun with your aliens trivia? No, I couldn't tell you, because I haven't really seen the movies. It, that's true. A lot of Indian, actually. Do you remember which one it was? Oh, of course not. It was the one where he spells the words on the floor, right? Why would I know that? All I remember that is means swinging it's... across a chasm with a whip. It's Last Crusade. It was probably Last Crusade, because that would have been certainly the oldest, or, or rather the newest game. Yeah. All right. We've got our hands on. All right. Well, let's give that a try. I, I meant we would have been the oldest before our three viewers laugh at me a month from now. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, or sex vixens from space. I still don't know how to get past the first screen. Well, did I extract your parks? I would have laughed if you extracted them to the Hotline Miami directory. Right? Alright. And now we are totally loading this thing. Sticky bear mask. Really? Okay. Oh, sticky bear typing. That's right. We wanted to see if we could break it. I will say, I've been playing around with Vice, the emulator. Yeah. And, um, I mean, I like it. I find it intuitive. I think it has some kind of internal recording system. Mm -hmm. But um, I'm sure whatever it is, you can't edit it like non-linearly, so I haven't messed with it. Yeah. The only problem I found is I can't get the keys to work. Like, it says Alt-S to save a screenshot, and it never works. Mm -hmm. And, like, I'm supposed to be able to hit Escape or something to skip levels, and that doesn't work, so... Whatever it works. Yeah, it's emulators. Oh, wait. Got a black screen. Improvement. Yes. Now, again, I don't know if this is your end or what, but the I see the emulator in a window within the Skype box. Uh, yeah, I think that's just Skype. I think we're yeah. good. Okay, well. Maximize your window. We gave it. Hi. Oh, normal. Go. Sticky bear typing. Sticky bear typing. Yeah, sometimes it just takes a while. Shift Alt F3, go. Oh. Oh. Uh, uh, how do you want stories stories dude I'm looking at sticky bear thump I think yeah. I had a dream about that one day now do you need to hit enter I hit enter and we're waiting Get set to maximum, maximum speed again. warp to maximum engage uh Sticky bear typing. Alt F. Oh, F3. Engage. There we go. Was okay. Let's come. <laughs> we Lord Boner. Riddles and jokes? Are you kidding me? <clears throat> I, I kind of want serious thinking because I'd like to see uh, hear the thoughts. <laughs> the thoughts of Sticky Bear. Yes, I bet he has a lot to tell us and teach us, really. Which, by the way, a new challenger has joined the stream. Introduce yourself. Oh, hi. I'm Swickles. 
Yeah. Yeah. Uh, some he's a real doctor. <laughs> oh my god. The diner in a restaurant said to the waiter, "Waiter, what soup is this?" Wow, does your backspace key not work? <laughs> Nothing. I I broke it. I hit enter what? ten seconds ago. Was it going to? Was it still set to warp speed? Maybe it, like a timer ran out, or as usual, you overwrote the buffer. I certainly did something. <laughs> Good. What he was trying to say is, I'm having a stroke. Yeah, that's what it. <laughs> Are okay. you typing K J J J J? Yes. Oh, yeah, okay. but it misses a lot. A diner in a rest. After about ten characters, just gives up. <laughs> well, maybe we need. This is a sign we need to go back to some serious thoughts. About as. Fast I'm as really I, curious nope. what the punchline is, though. I'm gonna Google it for our audience. New, new text. The waiter said, it's bean soup, sir. The waiter, ass. <laughs> I don't know what the backspace key is. It's not working. <laughs> is it escape? Uh, oh, oh, ex uh, quotation mark. Yeah. Remember the Commodore 64 had a slightly weird keyboard? <laughs> yes, just slightly. Well, oh, you, you have to hit enter at the end of each line. You can see it on the bottom. There's like the weird Commodore symbol, and the control is kind of up by QWERTY and stuff. The diner remarks, "Uh, too fast." <laughs> if someone was telling me a joke <laughs> that used the word "remarked," I would just walk away. Wait, what? That was, what? That was, Are there no punchlines in this that game? That was the joke. The punchline was, I don't care what it was, I want to know what it is. And this is not... Oh, because C is a reserved character in the... Okay, Indiana Jones. <laughs> <laughs> doder, doder. <laughs> yeah. Uh, Indiana Jones 3, let's do this. Let's play this fucker. <laughs> I don't know if you remember. I've been so curious about. Uh oh. You want to actually call them? <laughs> I'm on it. Let's see what a 503 number is. Yeah, make sure this isn't going to get me on some watch list. Yeah. Uh, yeah. I wouldn't actually call it TBH. <laughs> no, go back. What was it? It went on. Just see, look, look up a 503. 503 no. area code is in Oregon. Go back. Oh. I want to call this number. Really? Yes, for real. I will okay. put it on speakerphone. This will be oh a live call. This is the worst idea we've ever had. How Should, about you? Wait, shouldn't, shouldn't you get a burner or something? How about you Google this first uh, before you? Yep. Nope. Dialing. No. Oh my god. Yes. <laughs> Voicemail box of please leave a message after the tone and while we turn your call into the message. Oh, I was gonna call and ask for Dr. Jones. <laughs> I was really hoping someone had picked up. I think they probably got a change their number since then. <laughs> it seems that way. This Yeah, yeah this, this is totally the game I was thinking of though. This game got cracked in ninety six apparently, so Turns out whoop. Uh, oh, I'm okay because oh, I have. So yeah, I think I said infinite life. So I can <coughs> oh. do that. Oh well. Did you do infinite torch also? Probably because you, supposed... were... Probably you were busy panicking over <laughs> over the phone call. Oh. Yes. Ah, oh, there's. Whip it good. Wait, so the falling spikes don't do anything? Well, or... I. Oh. I think normally they would, but he's in like training mode. Oh, okay. yeah. Based on, or cracked it. Basically, I, I, you would die immediately. Yeah, we 
every time we try this, we do just terrible. So, oh, it's like that. Yeah. Oh, that yeah, was trainer nice can't handle that. Whoa, where, was that an axe? Yes. Oh. <laughs> Some that was an axe. How many are there in the Indiana Jones? Movie? Um, there's got to be at least one somewhere, like just in the background. Yeah. <laughs> So, true about the scene with the big swords guy that he shoots. It true yeah, that it it was supposed. He had, like, yeah, he had like food poisoning or something, and just wanted to like finish it up. So he just kind of ad libbed it and shot the guy. Yeah, it was supposed to be kind of a badass fight. Who, and, the, who had food poisoning, Harry or? Yeah. Yeah. Interesting. Like how and like whoops, 30, shit. So. And you know, they were filming in the friggin' desert and no one was having a good time. Yeah. Whoop, shit! How are you this bad at this game? <laughs> okay, <laughs> you know what? Like, even with, like, infinite everything. I can't progress. Um, okay, it turns out you don't need to press up or anything. Auto grab, and that's. Oh, oh. Oh. Great audience. Is there save states? <laughs> Unfortunately, every time we try to save state, the emulator cr What? That was the emulator crashes, so basically no. I mean, I'm telling you with Vice, I can't use the shortcuts to save state, but I can use the mouse and I can save state. So, it's that progress. Yeah. At least we could like do pirates for a few epis. Yeah. I love how I say Epi is like I'm Doug Benson. <laughs> I that never works. say it in real life, just when I'm playing when I'm like streaming. What the f <laughs> <laughs> We beat this game as kids. We did? I'm pretty sure we actually beat this game. This is legitimately all I remember. Oh, maybe it was a different maybe we just beat the first level and we're just like, yeah, we won. Maybe we were, that's not really possible. Well, I mean, it's like, you remember beating Goonies, I thought. I sure didn't. <laughs> Whereas I remember beating Alien, but I think that was the <laughs> emulator. Oh, what? my God. What are you supposed to do there? Can you light it on fire with your torch? Your ever-burning torch? And, and then what? Yeah. yeah. Oh, this is this is painful to watch. Play. <laughs> you start feeling bad for the girl, and you start feeling bad for the horse too. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. No, I remember this. Okay, oh. he's going up now. So no, don't, don't, don't. What? Okay, nothing. Too late. Too, yeah. Oh. Okay. I thought you would wait for him to come back down and see if he dismounts or something, but... Look at that old pixelated Harrison Ford in the corner. That's pretty good. That's like ascii prone almost. I mean, for two colors, like, yeah. Ah, ah, oh, oh. ah! Can you whip him? Whip him good? No. Probably not worth it. Speaking of Indiana Jones, man, I remember one birthday party at an arcade where there was an Indiana Jones game. This was also the first arcade that had Street Fighter. I think it was, I think it was regular Street Fighter, but it was on like a big magnified screen. <laughs> and I just remember they had an Indiana Jones arcade. No. Game. Oh. Oh wow. That Please we never you. beat. No. Oh god. And all I remember is like it was uh, Temple of Doom. And we couldn't figure out how to get past the first level, and then the time would run out, and the guy would just run up and pull out your heart. <laughs> I remember nothing about that game. What? I have, I've I've looked sure for that just, game. Are you sure you just haven't like crossed over like ski free with Indiana Jones? Somehow? <laughs> <laughs> I'm positive. I, I looked for it on like a Vame, like an arcade emulator. Never found the ROM. Same with. Do you remember there was a Ghostbusters like shmup? Yeah, it was a top-down sort of Ari Warrior style. Yeah, that game was wicked fun. I can't find that either. 
I yeah, remember it being really easy. Maybe it was because there were four hyper kids playing it at once. At first, yeah. Or play. Okay. I, I think one of the dirtiest arcade games ever was Double Dragon. Just that bridge with the water. I did. One Tiny time. little crack in you. <clears throat> yes. Yeah. So my, my uh, when I was growing up, my parents owned a, <laughs> a bar and restaurant. Oh yeah. And for the first couple of years, they had like they had pinball <laughs> machines in there, like two or three pinball machines. But then like they had uh, a few video games, and one of them was like Double Dragon. But since my parents owned the restaurant, I could literally sit there, put it a quarter, and just take the same quarter out over and over and like. Oh yeah. For because you know they had the keys and stuff, and even then. I even, think I lost patience for that game. <laughs> even then, you're like, I'm putting a lot of quarters in this. Yeah. yeah well, we beat it eventually. We, and remember? Yeah, we did, yeah. Mom was working at a candy shop, that, which for some reason had arcade games in the back. <laughs> and one of them, the only good one was Double Dragon, and we uh, we ended up beating it. Bad one day dudes that, also. What's that? They had bad dudes for a time, too. Oh, really? We beat that one as well. Well, the funny thing about that store, it was like the whole storefront had this back room, and eventually the candy shop went out of business. It became a comic book shop. Mm -hmm. And they kept that arcade had, games. In the they kept <laughs> the arcade games back. They're same arcade games. Then, like, the owners changed, and they upgraded the arcade games to Mortal Kombat. Still, I feel, I feel like arcade games are more in sync with a comic book store than a candy yeah. shop. Yeah, well, definitely. No, I, guess, I guess kids, you know, I mean, yeah, I, I, I guess I could see either one. I, I don't know if, like, the candy shop, if they intended to have, like, birthday parties back well, there. Well, remember they did for a time. I barely remember. Wait, and now those... we're stuck on this game. <laughs> what are those, like, red things on the wall that look like knives or something? There's not one on the screen. There was one a second ago. Oh. Yeah, right. oh, oh I think those are torches. Oh, I thought, like, you were supposed to do something. It, yeah, there's probably a place you're supposed to like swing across. I oh, would yeah, imagine. I need to. But I can't imagine they made the level this expansive just to waste your time. You can't? Really? Well. <laughs> the bad guy, I think that means progress. I would hope so. Aren't you going back the way you came? I think this is different because I'm not gotten stuck on that floor ceiling. Or, but it you know, does feel like I'm just looping around circles. Ah, okay. do I need ah, this? Get the, you know, is that supposed to be like the Holy Grail? Or? Do you not know what the Holy Grail is? Well, it's just a religious icon. I don't think. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if they were doing like that's a really shitty cup. I mean, <laughs> well, you know, the cup of a king. Oh, I chose poorly. <laughs> well, speaking of arcade games, maybe next. Why oh, would you do that? You. Oh. Well, that's good at least. Hey, not, at least I didn't land in spikes. Yeah. <laughs> so next game we should probably play is Rolling Thunder because I know that game at least works. I beat it. That I mean, was I on it. C64. Yeah, they they it was an arcade game, of course, and they ported yeah. it to C64. I played the hell out. Oh, of there it. we go. Like, that opens this ah, wall. The cross opens the door. Uh. Yay! Hey, yeah. we beat the game. <laughs> oh, I remember. Sir, Oh shit, you're in American Horror Story now. <laughs> <laughs> it does take place around here. <laughs> I've had. But, uh, oh, I got killed Whoa, by an angry it giraffe. Eats you. Oh. It swallows you whole. There, uh, there's like no damage. Line. Straight up of dead. All the, of all the circus animals. Yeah, <laughs> right? So Indiana Jones is regretting wearing his like natural hemp fiber pants. It had to be giraffes. <laughs> well, this. Of the yeah, this is supposed to be a oh, flashback. Okay. Yeah, that the... comes out, of course, after he escapes the cave with the cross. I don't think so. He's like, I'm not afraid of snakes, and then he falls in a pit of snakes, and he's like, suddenly I have a deadly phobia. Hey, I thought I could jump on its head. What are you, Mario? I. Hey, this yeah, is a yeah. realistic game based yeah. on a movie. <laughs> Plus, I mean, like, of all the animals that whose head you think you could jump on, like a giraffe, it's like the hardest animal t to jump on. Yeah. Yeah. Right? How do you An even... elephant? Nice broad head. A tiger. Furry, soft landing. <laughs> jump on its head. Huh. Do you see between the top and bottom of the grass they have a moving it? 
Oh, interesting. Maybe it's just perspective. Maybe, Although yeah, I think be off because the bottom yeah. could be faster, but oh yeah, yeah. I think it's some forced perspective attempts. Which I mean, you know, for a twenty-year-old game where the phone number of the crackers that watch it have changed, <laughs> not bad. Well, you say forced perspective, but it literally took me a few minutes to realize that wasn't water. <laughs> Because it's like sea green and wavy. Yeah, that's true. Then again, if they made it brown, it would just disappear. So how many options did they have? At least they didn't choose blue. Then I'd really be tripping. And that's what that, a shark so fan? So what, what is that supposed to be? Is that yeah, a I, rhino horn? Or... There's a narwhal in this circus. <laughs> they it's a wizard cap. <laughs> they animated a whole giraffe's head. And then, like, the <laughs> smallest portion of maybe a rhino. Yep. And this is not a this boring ass. This is, yeah, this is like. Shit! So, oh, no, 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 damn! Ah. Oh, man. Do you just zone out? <laughs> yeah. No, it's just you jump just a smidge late and you don't jump at all. So. You really anyway. do have to account for movement of the train. <laughs> yeah, right? This isn't Mission Impossible. Right. I think this uses what Unreal or maybe Frostbite. Uh, yeah, this is before you. Shout out to our friends making it. Nice. Uh, what is it? Blackfawn.com. Fawn. F A U N, not W. Oh. Oh, we've got there some action. There we go. Is that the end boss? Yep. Or was a cowboy <laughs> facing away from you? <laughs> okay. That, of course, like, just like in the movie, Indy murders him. I was about to say, like, I remember, like, when I hadn't seen the Indiana Jones movies, like, since I was, like, little, and then I went and watched them, like, you know, like, I was either, like, in high school or college, and I watched them, and I just remember thinking, like, this is much more violent than I remember. Oh, like, my yeah, gosh. He is not Isn't a cool it? guy. Yeah, PG. <laughs> Yeah. The eighties you could make anything PG. Yeah. <laughs> apparently well, I, I have some lightning bolts. Oh. Okay, apparently I use just timer or whatever. Why do you have an SS symbol now? <laughs> Z Z. Uh I think that's it's that. It lightnings maxes out it and then it starts over, but would that normally kill you? I don't know if that hurts me or if I need to do something, but you know what? Not a good mechanic anyway. It looks like it's destroying the little bags, but I could be wrong. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. Oh, oh, perfect. Now, if you didn't have infinite health, that may have killed you. Hey, Harry. Seem to be. So sorry, what Swickle, so You were dropping some knowledge about PG thirteen. Oh yeah, I don't like PG came around. I, I I'm a little fuzzy on it, but I remember like it was a it's a fairly new thing. Like I think it was only like in the like when they first had the ratings. I think it was just like R and like PG hmm. and G maybe or something or some variation. But I remember like there was a while where no one was really sure what to put what thing in where. So oh, nice. yeah. And then they somehow decided on bar mitzvah age, yeah, yeah as opposed to like driver's license age. Well, these kids are in middle school. I think they can handle curse words. Yeah, it's like how bad were the buses back then? Yeah, right. Whereas the comedian Brune would say, "Don't say shit, David." Say that. No, uh, the. At the Renaissance Fair, there's a comedian named Brune. His real name is Brian something. Um, he doesn't just do Ren Fairs, but he'll like, you know, he has a little lavalier, like a mic on his clothing. Uh oh. And he, oh, oh, oh wow. of all the jumps to miss. Man. You can't make that jump from there. I was about to say, it did not look like a doable. It was a pretty far jump, but I figured if I kept going forward instead of just going straight down at a certain point. Yeah, well, I mean, how would you have guessed you could climb up, oh, okay, that high and then hit your head and fall? Okay, that's the so, way. So oh, anyway, yeah. the, this comedian before 
I hate leaving stories hanging. Yeah. You know, it's like a family-friendly show. It's at the Renaissance Fair, and he, he interacts really well with, with families and kids and stuff. And then, you know, he'll do a trick that he messes up on purpose, and he goes, oh, shit. And then, the, you know, he'll always name some kid that he knows in the audience. So they go, ahem, and he'll speak right into the lob, and he'll be like, David, don't say shit. And it's fine because he says it twice then. Right. To emphasize is, saying it zero times. Yeah, this is why he's the comedian and I'm the, oh, see, the audience member. Jokes are member. so much funnier when you explain them. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Well, I'm you not... know what? If if we're lucky enough that Brune somehow hears this because we hashtag him, I mean hash brown him. Ooh. Then, then we'll Use that one. That's a good. All good. Yeah, I'll just keep every time we do tags for the video, we'll do eyebrows on fleek. <laughs> Cuz whenever I do that for our dog's page, he gets like 140 views. <laughs> and is it how what am I supposed to do? Wait, a can you Nope. Nope. <laughs> <laughs> Apparently not that. Can you climb all the way up to where you hit your head but then jump sideways? To the no, next no, rope. No, because no, after a certain distance, you go straight down. Oh, I see. I think I need to. Again, there there might think... be the thing you swing across with a whip. I I know that's a mechanic in this fucking game. I I think this will lead me to the secondary rope, which I couldn't jump to grab. Oh. And if I take that straight down, then I'll get the item. And nope. Well, you were close. Now, can you imagine if you also took damage from those fucking whoopee cushions falling on you this whole time? Yeah. It's just a slow burn. Whoops. No. Oh, that could have been worse. Yeah, it looks like you could have gone, uh... Er. This way. Why not? You know, we still know what those Z's do. Maybe they, like, destroy a wall temporarily or something. Thanks. Yeah. You're trying to, like, ninja guide in that? <laughs> yeah, exactly. That one. Okay. What? That pose looks like he's trying to hit a high note. How did that kill you? You have like infinite health and Yeah, I don't health. know. Some Ick. Well, he certainly wasn't JoJo posing. <laughs> Are you hitting the ceiling? Yeah. Okay. I'm here. <laughs> nope, okay. I know I've made this jump before. Have you? Yes. Were you doing that on There, see? Oh, good job. <laughs> First try. <laughs> so anyway, that last circus train reminded me. Do you remember that, like, cowboy game we used to play the hell I, out? I was thinking about that game, yes. Uh, I want to die. Go yeah, die that's there. another game we should try, although good luck figuring out the name. Yeah. Well, if my computers weren't in hell right now, I would look it up. I'm looking for wall chickens. <laughs> so I'm in Belmont. Hit Deborah Cliff with your head to make a hole. Can you jump sideways from What? What? Oh, oh, oh for are... God's sake. Is that a so climb you can, but those are spikes. So... Ornamental spikes that can <clears throat> kill you. But was that a climby grate? I couldn't tell. I was hoping, but Okay, but then you hit the ornament. Yeah. Right. Oh. oh, yeah, there you go. What? Why? You grab it. Oh, just try again. Try it's again. okay. You probably were just inputting too many commands. Now, let's see, can you just go over? Try, I... try, like, edging over. Yeah, no, I hit right, but maybe... Maybe just down? Not, or... Try down. All right. We've got eight directions. We're going to hit them all one by one. <laughs> 
What about lust? Oh, Oops. now you're dead. Thanks. <laughs> oh, that's ah. Oh. <laughs> okay, well we're it's progress. I just shake my head. I can't believe people made these games I and didn't... then sold them to children. <laughs> <laughs> then we beat them somehow. Like, if you were a grown-up and you knew how to code games, how did... you might, you know, uh, know what the fuck is going on, but there was no game facts. <laughs> there were no save states. Yeah. Yeah. This is why parents... This is probably why parents started buying video games. Like, I'll get the kids out of my hair for three days while they figure out this fucking <laughs> puzzle. Honestly, right. one I of go the up most... and jump... Okay. What? And one more time. Ah, honestly, one of the most intuitive games we've ever played on C sixty four has been Forbidden Forest. Yeah. Oh, I don't know. That typing game seemed pretty intuitive. <laughs> <laughs> well, you know, after all, the waiter wanted to know what the soup is, not what it was. Oh yeah, I missed the punchline. What was it? That was it. It was bean soup. Oh, that doesn't sound like a joke at all. Well, the guy asked what it is. Hey. Oh, must be the money. And the waiter said it was bean soup. Okay, we gotta ride him. Uh -oh. I was gonna say, did you just ride that thing? And we got I'll the be, punch. Yeah, we did. Be right back. Oh, I guess his friend is here. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. <laughs> <laughs> please, please. Oh, he's back. I wonder if that mouse could have clipped him off the end. That's what I was hoping for. Because <laughs> you're a masochist. Or maybe a sanist. I was going to say. Probably yeah. both in this case. Well, I am sitting here watching this game, so. Now, he said BRB, and I don't hear him talking, but clearly C64 AI isn't this good. <laughs> I was going to say. Or maybe it is. Oh, well. Oh, no. no. no! Yes! Yes! <laughs> My dreams have come true. Oh fuck! This has been Remy XT4. <laughs> oh, when's he coming back? Suit yourself. If you're there, we can't hear you, and if you're not, you missed out on something <laughs> golden. Should I call him? I think so. Oh my god. Remember in Indiana Jones and the Crystal Skull when this happened? Oh, that was the best part of the movie. That was actually, I think that was the audience experience. It's just dying over and over watching that movie. Okay. This is the weirdest. Yeah. Setup. Did you see, Did what you happened? see what happened? It's pretty weird. It is pleasant. Let me wrap up my stream and I will give you the full attention. So Did you see? Did you see what happened? I, I yes, and I've I'm smashing buttons, and I think this is where we end our <laughs> trial of Indiana Jones. <laughs> was that you though controlling it, or did the game? Swig? Hey, what's up, dude? Oh, how I get Dala? They can't hear you because I have headphones. Oh. But or he can't hear you guys, but but you can hear him. Yeah. Uh. All right. That's... Anyway, so. I love you guys. I love you so much. Tell him we love him too. They love With you mouth. too. Meh. Okay. Meh. Well, it suits yourself. Thanks for joining me. <laughs> and I'm Espresso fucking Steampunk. Wickles. <laughs> Alright, <laughs> bye.